During the late 1800s, also known as the Gilded Age, corruption was prominent. There were some people who used this time reconstructing as a way to gain a higher position or to gain greater wealth. Someone who was a prime example of that was Boss Tweed. Not only was he the leader of Tammany Hall, but he was also known for his political corruption. Welcome, gentlemen. It's been a long time since we met in the rain. How's everyone's company? People are criticizing us nowadays. Labor workers are forming unions to fight against us, especially the Populist Party. They're trying to get the government to be more involved in the economy. It's harder and harder for us to make the money. My friend, oh my friend, there's more than one way to earn the money, okay? I hear that the government is planning to build a courthouse in New York. <clears throat> in that time, we can force the government to raise the budget way much more than we actually need, okay? Once construction is finished, the amount of money, the amount of money we can make. Wow! We can make so much money! <laughs> what a genius idea, Twee! I know. I will join. Just make sure to remember me when you divide the money. <laughs> oh yeah, money! Okay. Later, I'll meet with someone to make a profit of a big deal with. Okay? I'll, I'll divide up the money later on. Mr. Tui? <coughs> Hi, Mr. Tui. I heard there's $350,000 set aside for the courtroom when you back built in the 58th. And currently, it's 1871 right now. And I heard a little birdie said the whole courtroom cost $50 million. And a furniture costs one hundred thirty thousand dollars. Care to explain yourself, Mr. Tweet? <clears throat> no need to explain myself. Actually, I'll just let the Benjamins do all the talking. Oh. I think we have a deal in here, Mr. Tweet. Glad to work in what we feel in the future. <laughs> it is my pleasure, little one. Just remember though, don't let anyone know about this transaction, this little deal we're making, okay? Or else you'll face something scarier than a law, if you know what I mean. Harper's Weekly played a major role in the downfall of Boss Tweed. But in particular, there was one man in Harper's Weekly who played the biggest role in his downfall. That man was Thomas Nast, the man in the red hat behind me. He was a radical Republican, but he was also a German-born American caricaturist and a political editorial cartoonist that was considered to be the father of all American cartoons. In this scene, you will see Thomas Nast and the manager of Harper's Weekly congregating about creating cartoons towards Boss Tweed and his scandals. Hey Nas, we got another job for you. This time, it's involving Boss Tweed and his scandals. I heard it's even bigger this time. He stole fundings for, from a co-host in New York. You should work on your cartoons. Sure, I can do it. All right, thanks, I'll leave it to you. Many hours later, can you publish this so we can end the career of uh, Boss Tui in his Tammany Hall political party so he doesn't ruin New York's economy? Yeah, this is good, but we need more. More? What do you mean? Yeah, we need more because we can't end his career with just these lousy cartoons. I just okay? spent several hours on this. We are Harper Magazine. Do you think this will end the career of this political machine? Huh? Fine, I'll just draw more. Alright, leave it to you. I'll never escape prison. I, I need to leave the country for it's too late. After all those deals and the amount of money I've made, everything is going down here. What do I do now? I I guess I can flee to Spain. I can go to Spain. I can I guess I can work at Seaman there temporarily for the time being. Wow, well, there's a fugitive in Spain. Spain has gone dangerous lately. Oh hi. Hello Mr. Seaman. How's your fishing today? It was it's great. Oh, okay. 
Oh, this is a nice day, nice weather. And whew, the breezes, the cool weather. Whew. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, he looks like a guy on the poster. Wait. Hey, police, police, police. He looks yes, like sir. a fugitive on the, on the posters. He looks like the fugitives. Go get him, get him, get him, please. So you're under arrest for all the all the crime you did in uh, America. What? He's uh, I'm just a seaman. I'm just a seaman. You have a right to remain silent. I'm not, I'm not who you think you are. Sure, you're right. Report. God, no, no, I'm not, I'm not a boss tweet. It's a boss tweet. Everyone run. Oh my god. Now we are back in this godforsaken jail. I've done so much for the city. Even after I did so much for the city. Almost, I stole so much money. To almost 200 million dollars. Even though I did so many terrible things. I helped fund the schools and hospitals. These ungrateful people. God damn it. I guess, <coughs> I guess I'll be going to sleep now. <laughs> oh.